Hello everybody and welcome back to another Evolve Flowers product focus and today I'm going to tell you all about the Flora Guppy. Flora Guppy is a really cool uh, planet friendly arranging tool so that anybody can arrange flowers however they like um, really easily without having to um, source other things to put them in, namely um, floral foam and such like. So this is a planet friendly option. It comes in two pieces. It's made from recycled uh, plastic and it can be recycled. And the two pieces, in order to put them together to make one sphere, you put into some warm water. That's why the kettle's here. <laughs> so we've had a cup of tea. We've just let it go off boil and we've put it in so that it's not too hot and as you can see it makes the uh, guppy go really malleable and bending as opposed to this one which is quite hard. So you've got a hook and an eye on there, a male and a female and you literally just push them together. If it becomes a little bit difficult then all you need to do is just put it back into the warm water and this will make it bendy again and make it easier to put together. So there we go. Once you've got it together, that's it. So if you've got those really tricky little vases that have got a strange opening at the top, you can just make it warm and squish it into the opening. Um, so you can use it for any any uh, any vase that's, that's not an easy shape. You can also fix them together. So if you've got a large display to do, or indeed a hanging installation to do, you can just um, cable tie them together with a plastic uh, plastic zip tie and just fix them together, and you can make a structure. Um, and then of course when the insulation comes down you can reuse them or indeed you can cross them into the, uh, to the display. So what are the advantages? Well especially if you're arranging in glass um, it's a really nice uh, medium to use, a tool to use because um, it's because it's clear um, once you've got all your stems in it almost disappears and you hardly see it. Also, you see you've got different sized holes all the way around the guppy. So we've got large holes and um, small holes and then some medium sized. So you can almost use it as a template so that you know um, where you're placing things. A bit like the old fashioned rose bowl that we used 30 odd years ago. The other advantage of this, perhaps over chicken wire, you're not going to scratch your nice glass vases. As you can see, I've got my best crystal out here. <laughs> what? <laughs> and it's got a beveled edge. So that means that when you're putting the flower stem into the, into the guppy, it's not scratching or it's not getting caught on anything and it's not damaging the stem. Particularly useful if you're using things like roses. Um, who don't like the, the stem being, being damaged. As you can see, I've got a couple of pieces of dowel here. Um, these would be used to balance the guppy across the top of your vase, and then you can arrange into it. So I'm going to show you how I do that now. In this oblet bars here with the sticks so that they are um, just having a slight um, raised effect so that the guppy is slightly above the rim of the bars. I'm just using the holes to measure where that should be. So I've got the circular centerpiece most uppermost. And then you can just place your stems through. Then we have some British foam solid seal. You will find you need to just balance a few things to start with. Today's the day I forgot my knife. But I dare say most of you will be using secateurs and knives so. Oops, 
stuff. And you see, it's very easy just to wiggle it into the into the glass through the duct tape. And one of the main advantages of using the guppy over anything else is that if you then decide you don't want to have the stem in that position, you have no problem at all just to take it out and put it in somewhere else. So if I decide I don't want that there, if it doesn't make a hole in anything, it doesn't get stuck in anything, you can just take it out and pop it in somewhere else. So this very loose casual arrangement, just with a few of our British seasonal flowers, not for anything in particular, but just to show you how easy it is to use the guppy and pop the stems in and out where you need to place them. Remember the usual um, tips and tricks that you don't put anything with any, any foliage below the waterline. That just makes sure that it keeps everything nice and clean. So here's our finished design of the uh, using the flora buffy into um, glass bars. And you remember earlier on that I um, used some, a couple of rods, you could use a couple of sticks, um, you, you could even use uh, twigs just to, to hold the uh, guppy in place while you're putting the stems in. And then the whole thing is very secure afterwards and you don't need to have the sticks. Of course, if you use something like um, pussy willow or some birch or something like that, then you can leave them in as an added feature. So one of the advantages of this is that you can make the designs. So imagining uh, if you're making lots of flowers for um, a wedding and they have to go in these vases, but you don't want to transport the vases, then you transport the vases separately um, and then you can transport your arrangement. The reason it's a little bit foamy is because we've used Pro 2 in the water. So if you, uh, you then can take it out, you can clean the vase, you can change the water to make them last a lot longer and just trim the bottoms and you can put them all back in again. And there we go. So a very easy um, arranging tool and um, yeah, planet friendly and um, easy to use. And when you've uh, finished with it, you can just put your, your sphere and your sticks in a safe place. Um, and, and you can then get them out again when you do your next arrangement. So um, I think it's a really cool tool to use. And I like the fact that we can use this in glass because we use a lot of glass. And um, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a bonus that you can take the flowers out and clean the bars and then put the flowers back in again. So there we are, there you have it, the floor of guppy.